I used to do this thing when I was little, raindrop racing. I'd fix on two drops. One would be me and the other one would be any kid in school who was doing all right. Like they had a nice mum and dad or a nice house. Mostly it was Charlotte Hughes because her mum worked at Greg's and put cream cakes in her pat lunch. Sometimes mine would brush up against another raindrop and I'd imagine that was when I was going to stay with Auntie Barbara or Mr and Mrs Den or Sam and Jason and then it'd drop off and roll down to the bottom. Aim of the game was that if you got to the bottom first, you'd be all right. Auntie Barbara, she wasn't a proper auntie, but she used to make me call her that for some reason. She used to say, not everyone can be all right, Marie. The world didn't like that. Some people are rich and some people are poor and some people's mothers work at Greg's and others don't. Not everyone can be all right. It's not how things work. I didn't have anything against Charlotte Hughes. She used to break me off bits of a cake if I asked for a bit. I weren't allowed to take a bite though. <laughs> She'd go, you've always got cold sores, Marie, and once you catch one, you've got herpes for life. <laughs> so I had my nose pressed up against the window, willing myself to stop hanging about and get to the finish line. Charlotte's would usually zigzag along, no sweat, but if it did brush up against another raindrop, I reckoned it was for something nice, like popping into a friend's for tea. And then she'd be on her way, clutching one of those party bags with flumps and fruit salad chews in it. Once, David Harper was the other raindrop, because he had a nan that knitted clothes for his action men. Still do it now sometimes, that game. Lorraine.